What's up, guys? I'm here trying to explain Genesis chapter 19, verse 24, right? Because people bring this up um, as a proof that God is more than one. And my whole mission with this video is to explain that this style of writing appears elsewhere in the Bible, not referring to more than one in what I call the disappearing third person. So what does Genesis say? Well, it says in Genesis chapter 19, verse 24, and then the Lord rained upon Sodom and upon Gomorrah brimstone and fire from the Lord out of heaven. I mean, yeah, it sounds like two, but how about first Kings chapter eight, verse one, then Solomon assembled the elders of Israel and all the heads of of the tribes, the chief of the fathers of the children of Israel, unto King Solomon in Jerusalem. So it's from Solomon unto King Solomon. Or Genesis chapter 4, verse 23, it says, And Lamech said unto his wives, Hear my voice, ye wives of Lamech. Now maybe if it would have had an additional title, like if it would have said God the Father versus God the Son, maybe it could be justified, right? Their claim could be justified. Now I'm just wondering if you think this is a fair comparison of verses on my end. If not, please let me know in the comments. Be blessed.